Okay, so uh, to begin with, if you're easily offended uh, by other people's religious beliefs or anything, you should just fuck off because I am gonna rant as hell on everything religious and spiritual. Actually, not very much about the religious part, more about the spiritual parts. Um, there's this show in Sweden called um, The Unknown. It's basically an old, um, occult program about, um, well, the well, the unknown, the spiritual, the ghost, shit like that. It's usually about poor families that had lost uh, someone dear to them since long ago or recently, and that calls in a psych, or psychic, whatever, to um, go inside the house and say everything that their loved one wanted to uh, say to them, or, uh, well, say to them before they died, or they're running around trying to ding, 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 hey, I'm trying to speak to you, my alive little brother. I can't stand these fucking programs and people. How do you have the stomach to go into a stupid fucking person's house because they believe them, not because they're support religious, but because they believe these people, and you can go on around and fucking act out that you sense something and that, you know, there's worrying going on here or blah 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 or that someone's unhappy or very happy or wants to say this to you. I can't fucking stomach this. and. The people that hire these people and pay money for them are fucking swallowing it all whole. I can't, you know, I can't blame people for being stupid, you know, I, I, ju I just can't. But to me, they're fucking dumb in the head. I'm not saying that spirits do not exist. I'd actually like to believe that spirits do exist. I just don't believe it, but I like the thought. What I do not believe is people claiming that they can feel spirits and... Uh, know what they're saying, know what they want to say to the dead people and persons, and they're swallowing this all up, and I fucking can't grasp this. They're swallowing it up, and, you know, they start crying, and you really see how sad or slash happy they get for swallowing this fucking lie where their father says, oh, I, you know, I'd like to say that, you know, I was abusive of you, but I loved you. Shut up, I'm in the middle of a fucking rant. It's... I can't, I, I can't comprehend this. I can't comprehend how someone can be so fucking heartless or delusional that they think that they can contact the spirit world. Let's just face it up like this from the facts like this. Why the fuck would you, as a spirit, if you had the power, go around and bug the people that are alive, bug the people that you love slash do love still, instead of just going down right then in their fucking face, up to them and say, you know, sorry, or, you know, fucking appear like Jesus or God or whatever the fuck you'd like. And tell them everything you want said, and have a conclusion, and then fuck off to heaven or hell or whatever the freaking hell you needed to go. I... Why do people think that they, if spirits exist, why would they need this special power to see them? Well, am I not worthy of seeing my dead mother? If she'd like to contact me, or am I not blessed by God to get this power to contact my dead mother, but a random dude making fucking money out of this is... I don't fucking understand this! <laughs> and, you know, I'm sorry, but people like that are fucking stupid. I'm not saying people that are religious are stupid, I'm not saying people that believe on the spirits are stupid. Generally, I do not have high thoughts on people like that, but there's a difference. There's believing in God, and then there is sacrificing your chicken in the backyard. Uh, there's a difference, and you know, people believing in God, I have no problem with that. Not at all. In fact, several of my friends believe in God. but. I just, people, oh, I, I remember watching a show, um, there was this, uh, kind of the same thing, but in this case you didn't even have the guts to go into someone's house, you had this TV show, and then there was this one guy, guy who walked out and everybody applauded, ah, oh, yay, he's coming out, and then, you know, you've all heard this story, I think South Park did it as well, and, um, Kyle was ranting on this. And um, he goes out and he says, well, blah, 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 something, and yes, I feel, uh, I feel a lonesome spirit here uh, with the K, G, something K, B, B, Arnold. Oh, you, oh, you, oh, your brother's name is something B, Bjorn. Let's take a Swedish name because of it. Bjorn. Oh, oh yes, yes, yes. I, I felt a B strongly here. They just continue to edge out all these fucking things that are so generic. You know, your brother died. He's sad because he died. Oh really? You fucking serious? No, he wanted to leave his sister and his brother and his mother behind when he died prematurely. You know, no, 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 he's happy about dying, you know, who wouldn't be? And 
the people are just swallowing this hole, and you know the best thing about this, it doesn't matter where the fuck you're from. You know, I I have some uh, stereotypes about people. You know, I used to have stereotypes about Americans, lots of stereotypes about Americans. I still kind of do, but not as much. Yes, I'm a cruel fucking bastard. I know, but I have several American friends to prove that I have changed my ways. Anyhow, and you know that's the best part of it. You can't limit this to a country. You can't limit this to. Uh, Bestiality, Sweden, Norway, Finland, Brazil, blah 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 blah, or whatever the fuck animals, so they do incest there, or hillbillies, everything. You can't do that, this is world fucking wide! And. Shut the fuck up, I said. Uh, I, I just can't. I, I, I just can't comprehend this. Uh, but I lost track here. What I can't comprehend is how people can be either soulless or so fucking delusional that they get a conclusion about someone that's. Have d that have died to them, you know, this, um, you know, someone says that, you know, a lie, you know, it doesn't matter, you know, as long as you feel good. I can't, I can't swallow that, you know, I call me a cruel person, but fake happiness, and yes, I am saying that if a person comes into your house claims to be able to talk to your dead family member and s lies to you straight up to your face uh, and you swallow it whole and then you're happy for the rest of your life. I don't call that happiness. I am calling that denial. It's... You can't talk to, you know, your family member. I will not buy because I am not believing in any way or how. But I can accept if you say that my dead sister came to me in my dream, talked to me. I can accept that, you know, be, you know, whatever. But I cannot accept that a stranger goes into your house that you pay for. And, you know, they're a con artist. Nothing more. They're a con artist. Out for your money, out for your cash, out to touch your heart. And, you know, as I said before, people say that, you know, happiness doesn't matter, you know, if it's real or not, as long as they're happy with it. You know, no, I, I don't think so. You know, to them person, okay, yeah, but for the, uh, the psychic, I don't think they have the fucking right to do anything like that. And, I don't know, it's just, it really aggravates me, it angers me, it makes me fucking furious. Uh, I'm not the kindest people, I'm the kindest guy on earth, you know, I am not. You know, I am, I am kind, I am cruel, I am everything in between, you know, so, and I think most people are. But these people have a profession of fooling people, conning them. And I'm not talking gypsy conning to survive, I'm talking exploiting another person's death. You know? And exploiting another person's suffering. And, you know, the result, they feel good, yeah, but, you know, while they're feeling good, they're standing there. <laughs> yes! Hundred dollars right in my pocket, you stupid fucking bastards! It's... It's infuriating, you know, I, I, I think that just pisses me off. And this is my, you know, rant on that, and I'm just gonna sign off. Yeah, I'm, I, uh, I'm sorry, you know, reply on this, for the love of God, if you'd like to. Reply if you think I'm a douchebag, reply if you think I'm right, or if you think both between... Is it black or white, is it grey, you know, anything, I'd like replies. Bye.